Hi, good afternoon. I like to welcome you to Poem Praise 2. And I do thank you for tuning in and peace and blessings be upon you and your family this afternoon. Now, I know it's been a, a few days since I last spoke with you here on Poem Praise 2. Now, this is just going to be a free flow in regards to work. I'm going to call this workout. The reason why I'm going to call this workout is because through this previous week, I just want to share with, with you guys because I had some things go on, conversations that I'm thinking to myself and I'm about to share with y'all when you're working it out, when you're putting in work, okay? Now, let's say, let me just give you an example. Follow me with this example. Let's say you have one individual, they're working 12. Let's say they got a long day, they're going to do 12 hours, right? Okay? And you got another individual, they're doing eight. Let's say you have another individual, they're doing five or four. Now, for the individual that's doing 12, let's just say that that's my schedule. Okay, I know my schedule, right? You doing eight, you know your schedule, right? You doing five, you know your schedule. You doing four, you know your schedule. Now, sometimes when you out here and you got a long schedule, it actually affects the individuals who have a shorter schedule. Let me put it to you like this. Let's say the eight hour talk to the 12 hour. Like, you know, you got a, a, a long shift. You know, you're going to be doing a shift. Um, you know, your shift is l longer than eight. I'm, I'm just putting some words out there. This ain't the exact synopsis of the words but let's say do you know that you're actually doing longer than 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 nine do you know you're doing longer than ten now I just uh I just uh set the set the stage for you to let you know about the twelve the eight the five the four right so the twelve I already know so this is my comment a little bit to the to the eight now why should what I'm doing affect you? Now, if I'm putting in the 12, and Lord knows I, I got the energy enough to put in 12. Uh, you see me? <laughs> you, you, you know the DNA, the ancestors that I have on my DNA that used to be up from sunup to sundown with various types of breaks. You talking about 12, put in the work, put in the time. How is uh, the hours I'm doing making you tired? You're not even the one doing the work. Mm. Mm. Did I just hear something there? Why is it that other individuals should get tired when you're the one that's working? So take into consideration, you know, let it be determination. Let it be motivation when you look, observe, when you actually see someone that's doing something that you would like to do yourself, right? So therefore, knowledge of yourself, knowledge, wisdom, understand Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So this is just in regards to just well, when you're working out. <laughs> the observers. Looking all around, you know, because observers are they're they're watching, they're observing the work. Now Here's something that just came to mind. How 
are you going to be able to enjoy the fruits of your labor if you don't put in any labor? Even with dealing with a farm, if you don't till to the ground, if, if you don't till to the seeds that have been planted, how are you going to reap a harvest? How are you going to be able to, to go through the field and be able to, to glean from the harvest? Mentally, emotionally, spiritually, physically. You know how when you work out, since I'm saying this workout, you have to work out more than one day in order to see the effects of the workout. You know, and while you're working out, you might get aches and pains because you're really not used to the working out process, right? You got to get uh, to the point where you're actually getting used to it, right? It starts in the mind first because the mind and the body, right? Up here in the dome, right there, right there. You see it right here? I'm, I'm tapping on B, but I want you to see it too, right there. Okay, it starts up here, right? So then all of a sudden, you're working it out, Okay. Got to work it out. And so while you're working it out, okay, I was just talking about aches and pains. So no pain, no gain. But then after you go through that little bit of pain, then you start to get used to it. Okay. Okay. All right. Long day. All right. And then uh, some days don't just do it long every day because uh, periodically when you have the workout, you have to have days of rest, right? days of rest so so you can rest and re replenish and restore and rejuvenate that that's just kind of like you have a cup and all of a sudden you gotta fill the cup back up you see it's getting a little bit empty you're, you're feeling a little bit empty so therefore you got to fill it back up don't forget to feel periodically throughout your workout. I'm going to repeat that to reiterate. Don't forget to refill periodically through periodically in the midst of your workout. Needs to be done. in order for the workout to actually uh, come to the fruition of what you're working out on. So now I could tell you a little bit, but then sometimes with the workout, depending on what you're working on, really don't have to talk because then you'll see the effects of the workout, right? If someone is working out and they're doing it on a continuous basis, you're going to see something. Without a doubt, you're going to see something. So, continuous for the workout. And this is going to end my free flow of workout this afternoon. Now I do have some things to tend to, so I'm certainly going to bring this particular poem praise to a close. And don't think I forgot. No, I didn't forget y'all about the books. Yeah, we're going to get back to the books. Can you see that? Well, if you can't see it, because I was getting a little bit of a glare, I can actually spell what it says, okay? And during in the midst of your workout, don't forget to R-E-A-L. Don't forget to. Okay. That was real. R-E-A-L.
<laughs> but what I was meaning to say to you, I want you to be real. Mm. Mm. And R E A X. Relax. We're going to get back to the books. Uh, here, if you want to listen to other books here on Poem Praise 2, we do have, it's going to be on the playlist uh, where you can actually go to the title of the book and certainly read at your leisure uh, what I have on the books. I have five steps to real estate success. We do have for men only book for men only that I'm reading. We do have the names of God. Also, I have great African American women. And I don't actually, one moment. I certainly do thank you for your patience and waiting till I get back. Uh, the last book I have on there is the, the ABCs of life, which with this one, we're on letter number T. So those are the books that you can actually uh, review and listen to. Now I have read other books on this channel. So if you do see any other book on the playlist that you would like to listen to at your leisure. Go ahead, listen, like, share, and send it to a friend who would like to subscribe. But until I speak with you again here on Palm Praise 2, I want for you and your family to have peace and blessings be it upon you and it be at thy will i will speak with you soon here on poem praise 2 till next time later y'all <laughs>